Okay, so uh, here's the deal. Last uh, last month, Chicago Magazine puts out a list of their top 10 sandwiches. And, uh, and last weekend, I unfortunately had six of them. Uh, they were so good that I decided to push on this weekend. So now I'm sitting outside the Lulon Bakery. And um, there's a line starting to gather. Um, I'm going to go in here and get the, uh, the number five um, ranked sandwich which is their uh, new line, number one special. I'll let you know how it is. Smells absolutely fantastic in here. Back and this is uh, the number one special from New Line Bakery. As far as Chicago Magazine is concerned, this is the holy grail of Vietnamese sandwiches here in Chicago. Um, what I'm seeing is uh, some ham. Uh, looks like head cheese, some uh, pork pate, uh, pickled daikon, jalapenos, some carrots, cilantro, and all of that stuffed inside a what looks to be an airy house-made baguette. Um, this is, uh, this looks good. It's, it's incredibly unfortunate that I have to eat all of these sandwiches in my truck, but, um, but I'll get to work. Hold on. Um. Well, I'm um, really. I'm having a, a tough time wrapping my head around this sandwich. Um, it's certainly tasty. Um, I think that pork pate um, certainly gives it a. Almost some depth and the freshness of the cilantro and the pickled daikon, the jalapenos. Um, is obviously classic Vietnamese sandwich. Uh, I'm not sure that um, this is a, a genre per se that um, I would seek out uh, with all the, the gate sandwiches in Chicago. I'm not sure that this marks into my top five, but mm, certainly good. Uh, and if I like Vietnamese sandwiches, I, I suppose I would, I would like this, um, but uh, isn't uh, isn't something I would drive uh, halfway across the city for. Um, that being said, uh, I will struggle through the rest of this, and uh, and then um, push on to the next.